What's your name and badge number? Officer Isabel. 9536. Did you say Officer Isabel? Yes, sir. And what's your badge number? 9536. And your name and badge number? These San Antonio, Texas Park Police have been caught violating the law. While on break, they have parked their cruiser illegally. So there's no parking any time from that pole on down that way. Jack Miller, an independent journalist, is recording and confronting the officers. Well, you, so you want me to back up? From me. But you, you won't you tell me your name and badge number. You had your number. elbow in my face, sir. Oh, okay. So you had your elbow in my face. Can you again just tell me your name and badge number since he has a problem with me getting close? Well, when somebody's sticking an elbow in my face, I have, you know. So I'll, I'll take a step over here to the right. Absolutely. Thank you. Okay. Can I approach and get your name and badge number? Because I still don't know it. Well, you know what? Uh, I got one better for you. You want to talk to my sergeant? Hey, Gary. And 321 badge number is 9854. I'm getting a contract right here. I just want to know who's no, no, driving I'll, that I'll car. I'll get my sergeant on the report. Okay. I just want to know who's driving that car. Because it's parked illegally. Okay, well, we'll get my sergeant over here. Do I have any homicide monitoring? You guys on break? Yes, sir. Within minutes, the sergeant arrives. How you doing, I'm sergeant? I'm the, was... Yes, I'm the one that they're calling. Okay. I'm Sergeant Barrientes, New York. Good citizen. Can What's you your uh, badge number? 9572. All right. I'm sergeant Barrientes. Yes, sir. So um, I, I went and asked uh, the officers up there who was driving that patrol car over there. Um, I didn't know if you're aware. And I, I'd like to inform you. Uh, Transportation Safety Code. 546001 and 002 uh, define when you guys can park in a no parking zone as well as when that conduct is permissible. Do you, do you have an ID so I can train? I need a, I need a ticket written. Okay. Do you have a, uh, an ID? So I can put you, know who I'm talking to, who my complaint is going to be? Yeah, I'm not, not going to provide ID. What's that? I'm not going to provide ID at this time. Okay, that's do, fine. Do you know somebody that can uh, write that vehicle a ticket or have it moved? It can be moved, sir. Okay, if, if it's moved out of that no parking zone, we got no problem. Okay, sir. A few minutes later, the park police moved their car. So they did move their vehicle. Excellent. Good job, guys. Good job indeed, especially to citizen journalist Jeff Miller. Hello, everybody. I'm David Schuster, and thanks for joining us. For those of us who have gotten more than one or two parking tickets, this confrontation is exceptionally satisfying. Finally, police who are on their break are forced to comply with the same traffic laws and parking laws applied to the rest of us. In this case, however, the officers were confronted by a white man. Would the police have stayed this calm if it was a black citizen confronting them and recording their badges? One would hope these particular officers would have responded the same way. But we know that a lot of cops react differently to black men than white men. So it's always wise to make sure you are recording. Also, there are some states and cities with ordinances that allow police to park illegally at any time of day or night. However, plenty of jurisdictions tell police that if they are not investigating somebody or something, the cops must comply with local traffic and parking laws. And that excuse of, oh, I'm just double parked for a moment, doesn't fly. So the next time you've gotten a parking ticket for being in a no parking zone, take some satisfaction in what happened in San Antonio, Texas and what's happening across the United States. A growing number of citizens are reading up on local laws and ordinances and making police comply. And for everybody's protection, these citizens are keeping their cameras rolling. Bravo and power to the people.